Hello to all. In this tutorial, I want to explain shortcuts built in stabilization. The accuracy settings should be set to maximum for best results. The only bad effect setting this value too high is the longer analyze time while editing. I did never experience a shakiness factor higher than 8 useful. Setting the shakiness too high can make the stabilization unstable and adding micro jitter. Changing the accuracy and the shakiness requires the long-lasting reanalyzing process. The smoothing is a relative crop zoom to the total video movement and it is the main factor to stabilize the video. For a stabilization lock, this value should be set to 100%. Because the smoothing doesn't make relative crop related to the total movement of the clip this value changes from clip to clip dramatically and can lead sometimes to a too high zoom factor. It is sometimes better to keep the smoothing low and use instead the position, scale, and rotate filter because with this filter you can choose the crop position yourself. Now I show all beginners how to add the stabilization filter to a video. Cut the clip before starting the analyze of the stabilizing because any cut requires an additional analyze process again. Moving grass and windy situations required to set the stabilization lower. If the video looks after the stabilization jelly try adding the 3D noise filter to remove out some jelly effect and hide an unnatural motion blur popping up sometimes. Thanks for your attention and good luck editing your videos.